and welcome back to my channel also happy new year it's insane that it's already we're in a new year 2022 which is insane i felt like just yesterday we started 2021 but here we are so today's a different video no reaction but i'm gonna tell i'm gonna show you guys or tell you guys my top songs my favorite songs that i listened to in 2021 that came out in 2021 so i'm doing 21 song for 21 it's not in any specific order i just wrote what i remembered and there's still a lot more songs that i listened to and were my favorites in 2021 but i just wanted to show you guys also i hope this year is very sweet for you guys it's very fruitful that you know all your dreams and goals be completed in 2021 2022 and that you know it goes all well and that you guys stay healthy for the rest of the year and you know be successful and be happy and remember i'm always here for you guys it's another year here in youtube i believe this is my second year if i'm not mistaken which is just which is insane but yeah let's get straight into the video well, i have the list right here i wrote it all down literally 21 songs it was hard i mean it was easier than i did last year last year me and amy did it um and it was a struggle because <laughs> that's when 2020 um for me and i believe for amy it was we were just getting into k-pop so we had a lot of songs that were our favorite but they were not from 2020 but here i am with from 2021 I, like i said earlier there's still so much more songs that i wish i could add but these are the ones so let's start with the first one which is i put one day by monster x i freaking love that song that song is so like it hurts but it's so good i i freaking i listen to it all the time at work i watch the music i just i love that song freaking love it um the second one is permission to dance by bts one there's a lot of songs with bts that i love obviously because bts is like my number one group they are my they're my safe haven for me and permission to dance i mean butter and dynamite and butter was really good but permission to dance i really really loved it it's you know it has a really good like meaning to it and it's very beautiful and i love and in the music videos and when they did the live performance they all look super happy and that makes me happy so i had to put it in my top you know in my in this list third one is after midnight by astro i don't show it a lot that i love astro but i i love i mean it has i have a poster of astro right here i love astro they're one of my my groups i love them so much and this song after midnight it's so fun to listen to it's very poppy it's very retro i just love it it's a good song to listen to you know to put your mood up the fourth one is favorite by nct 127 i freaking love that song that song i feel like it was one of their best um comeback song it's amazing the music video is freaking amazing the vocals the rapping the choreography is my favorite it's just a great song overall and i could listen to it so many times and i love nct i nct is one of my ultimate groups um so i listen i love anything of nct talking about nct the next one is rainbow by nct dream i love that album i have that album hot sauce amy also she bought me the album for my birthday freaking love it i love this album i could listen to this album so many times specifically this song rainbow the lyrics is so beautiful you guys should definitely listen to rainbow it's such a beautiful song their vocals it's so i love this song this song is so beautiful the next one is also from NCT Dream, Hot Sauce. That song is such a bop. It's so like, the rap is so swaggy. It's just the music video is freaking cool. I just, I love it in general. As you can see, I love NCT and it's just, I had to put these three of NCT because I listened to it a lot this year. Next one is from Stray Kids and it's Red Lights. This is with Bang Chan and Hyunjin. This freaking song, insane. It's very sexy it's just their vocals bang if you guys don't know bang chan is my bias in stray kids and he is one of my ultimate biases and hyunjin i love hyunjin i love him as a dancer he's a great dancer great singer he's a great person they're both great and their vocals together mashed up so well the lyrics very very hot like very spicy but it's just it was amazing i freaking loved it next one is by treasure and it's my treasure this one is also such a beautiful song i love listening to it 
I don't show it as often that I listen to Treasure, but I do listen to Treasure quite often. They are one of my favorite groups. Um, but Treasure, this song, My Treasure, the, the music video is beautiful. The lyrics is beautiful. It's so heartwarming. It's so like down to earth. It's so genuine. I just love it in general. So that's what my other favorite. Next one is by 18 is Deja Vu. I could watch this music video so many freaking time with no problems. I freaking love this song. The music video, amazing. The vocals, the rapping, especially Hung Joon part killed me and Mingi part killed me. And I freaking loved it. Another one, the next one is also from 18, it's Internal Sunshine. I listen to the song at least maybe three times a day. At, at work, I'm always listening to it. I'm always watching the music video. I love um, Song Kwon's part. I love all the parts. They're so The song is so wholesome as well. It's very bright and colorful. It's very, it brings the mood up. If you're in a bad mood, just listen to Internal Sunshine. It makes your mood so much better. It makes you happy, which I love. The next few is from Seventeen. Seventeen is also one of my ultimate groups, and I just had to put a few of theirs. So this one's Rock With You. This is their latest one. Uh, the song is freaking amazing. I love Ming Yu part. I love Wonu's part. I love all the other parts, but this song is just. And June and D8 was there, so I just. I love them. I This song is amazing. I could listen to it all the time. The next one is also from 17, 2 minus 1. This is Vernon and Joshua, their first like English song. At first, I did not like the song, but it just grew on me. I could listen to it, and I watched the live clip that they did for this song. I could watch it so many times. I freaking love that song. Next one's also from 17, it's Anyone. This one, amazing. It's just, all of their songs are amazing. But I love the music video to it when they were in there in that uh, track, the space, the race track. I freaking love that video. The choreography, the rapping, the singing. This song is just amazing. I could listen to it all the time. Then the next one, finally, 17, is Ready to Love. This song is so beautiful. It makes you want to fall in love like i feel like that song kind of represent what love falling in love feels like and i love it and it's just like it sounds like they're in love and it makes me happy which i love the next two is from bi the first one's isla isla i freaking love this song this album first of all waterfall this album is freaking great it's one of my favorite albums of all time of this year it's one of my favorite album i could listen to this album so many times but the song isla isla the lyrics they hit deep they're very deep lyrics but you can feel his emotion you can feel everything which i love that's what makes me love the song the next one from bi is numb i listen to the song all the time all the time i love the song the song is also good it's the vibe that it gives the sound i just love everything about it the next one is by twice if you guys know me i'm not i'm not a big i'm not big fan of girl groups i don't listen i barely listen to girl groups but this song, The Feels, their English song, I it's so good. It's so freaking good. The choreography, I love the choreography, especially the chorus one. I, this song is so good. The music video is really good. The vocals, them, they're all so beautiful. And this song, it's just, I listened to this, this song a lot this year when it came out. Next one, the last, the next two is The Boys. The first one's Maverick. That song is so freaking crazy. It's so awesome i love the music video the music video is freaking crazy they're acting the production the lyrics to the song is crazy the sound the performance everything about it i love and i love the boys they are my one of my favorite groups i have them right here as a poster and the next one thrill ride this one's also from the boys this song is also really really good it gives such a summer feel such a fun vibey feel you know i just love it i love the choreography the vocals the rapping everything about it is just amazing the next one is from a solo artist a solo artist eric Nam, and it's his latest song i don't know you anymore this song is amazing if you guys don't know i love eric Nam. i i even bought tickets for his concert he's coming in march so i'll be going to his concert that's how much i love him love him and the song is very very good it grows on you and it's just i, re I highly recommend it the last one it was very hard because there was other songs I wanted to put, but of course I can put it. So the last one is TXT, Loser Equal Lover. This song, it's so great. I love this song. The music video, the choreography, very rock. I love it. TXT never fails with those. And this song, I love it. The Like I said, I love everything about the song. This song is amazing and I have been listening to this one a lot. 
but yeah those are all my 21 songs that i have listened to of course there's way more that i have listened to but i just narrowed it down it was very very hard towards the end because i was like i want to put this i want to put this but i couldn't but yeah let me know in the comments down below have repeat you know on repeat 2021 um but yeah i'm gonna make a playlist on spotify now looking down below so you guys could you know check out the you know the playlist if you haven't listened to most of these songs you guys can check it out there but yeah, happy new year guys. I love you. Also, if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe. I haven't subscribed so yet. Also hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post a new video. Also, I do have a Patreon where I'm reacting to quite a few things. And yeah, I love you guys. See you next time. Bye.